Hi, this is Miranda from My Scrappy Life, and welcome back to my channel. This is a process video for Spiegel Mom Scraps, where I am going to be using one of the collections that was released a couple months ago called the Froelich, Froelich Along, along with using my discount code, which is Miranda15, in the discount section of the website and you will get 15% off of your order. Now I am using my November sketch that is in my group for the monthly crop that I host um, monthly and it is free to go. Everything will be linked down below in my description along with Spiegel Mom Scraps, my crop and all of that. So what it is is that I'm combining two challenges into one. So the challenge is actually called the recipe challenge that is done by Moira, which is one of the design team members that I'm on with too. And it is to incorporate one of the other sketches um, or one of the other challenges that's within the month. And so she used the sketch, so I decided to use my sketch. So I kind of um, done two within one, um, within one challenge. And then it's to use a leftover kit, which is what this is. I am using up the November, one of the um, hip kit collections. It was one of the autumn collections that I've been using um, since September, I think. I wanted to get it used up because these are the last two photos that I have left of the trip in the, the wine trip that I went on um, last year. And then these two photos actually are my last for October. And I will be going into my November section of what I want to scrapbook from last year. Now it is also says to use um, a packaging technique or rub-ons, wood, it could be button, veneer, wood grain paper, background stamps, embossing folders, etc. Anything that's wood related, I will show you where that comes into play. Phrases, acrylic stickers, acrylic chipboards. I have that acrylic phrase that says love you so much. That is from Colorcast Designs, which you can see off to the side. It was just released here in October. And I um, is using it on there because it is a picture of KJ and of my husband Josh when um, they show up here shortly when I get to that. And then it says, um, that is it. So I put it all together and I will link everything down below along with um, Moira's YouTube video to this collection because um, that gives you like two takes, not only on this sketch, but then also on her take of using her recipe challenge that's in my group. Now, make sure that, like I said before, this is for Spiegel Mom Scraps, so make sure that you go check out her website. Um, this month, she is like stash diving all of her um, collections that she has released for um, sequence mixes and doing that. So that is what I am doing here. I um, went back a couple months and used that because I knew that this one was still on the website, at least as I am doing this voiceover. Um, hopefully, it's still available. Otherwise, just use my code 15 Miranda for 15% um, off of your order. Um, that would be greatly appreciated to hit up that small business. Now, I'm just kind of playing around with my photos and the placement of this title. Because as you can tell, there's a title, the big title's off to the side, and then there's this big old, on my sketch, it's like the embellishment section. So I wanted to place my title there just because of how this one is. So I'm placing the title there. Um, here comes those rub-ons. Now, HipKit makes their rub-ons just a little bit differently. They actually just peel off and you place them down. They're like a, they're semi like a rub-on, but semi not because it's kind of a clear style sticker but I know that these are rub on you know that th it's like a rub on feel so I'm kind of using rub ons here for um like the packaging technique because I wanted to not really do mixed media on this one so I like how this rub on has that mixed media feel and then I'm just placing in those hearts that need to go in the middle of this one and then that pretty much is done here on the bottom. I just love how this title works. And it says, love you so much with the three little hearts. And it kind of matches my cluster down on the bottom. Now, here comes the wood veneer. I have where it says, I think it's fall leaves is going to be my side title here, which is like what the big title is supposed to be. 
um, on the side of that. And I placed that there, and these are wood grained. So there is the wood veneer style um, challenge part of the recipe. Challenge that um, is part of this one for November. And it's got this wood grain feel. And I use one other, I think I use one other piece off of there as well. Um, the rest of them are like uh, houses and stuff. And I just wasn't quite ready to use those up yet. So I'm just going to go through that. And now I'm going to go through the embellishments as well. I am speaking with other individuals. I am Zooming with some friends. So I'm not real. I'm, sometimes you'll see me stop and talk. I got to learn how to hit pause or whatever instead of like talking and using my hands and not doing anything on my layout. <laughs> I got to I got to get better at that. Um but these are the last two photos for the month of October and also of last year and also the um of this trip. That actually works out to where it is completely done and then I can move into the no November stuff. Now there isn't that much in November that I am covering other than like Thanksgiving. Um, Josh actually started last year at this time. He started his like his internship for the military. So that's part of it on there. And then um, I did do my very first uh, crop through um, scrapbook cards today. Scrapbooking cards today I think is whatever it's called. That was my very first time of doing that last year. And then I also have where I got my 10th publication in from um, uh, Creative Scrapbooker. Um, I ended up getting the 10th. I'm now on to the 11th or 12th I think for, the, for my time frame of being um, published. But I absolutely love doing this. It's one of those things that I love to do. I love scrapbooking. I just love doing all of this. It's so much fun. Um, so here I am. I'm going through the embellishments. I just wanted to add some little things here and there. Kaylin always loves being a bunny. Um, she loves bunnies and things like that. So um, I was like, ooh, I can finally use this bunny up because I keep trying to figure it out. So here is the grand, if you want to call it the grand finale, here is the sequence mix that I am using. It is um, called Frolic Along. I think she used, um, this was released August of this year. And so I've still got quite a bit of it, as you can tell. You get two, um, I think it's two teaspoons of, either two teaspoons or two tablespoons. It's got to be two tablespoons of um, the sequence mix. So you never know which what amount of what you're going to get. But I absolutely love um, Spiegel Mom Scraps. She has an amazing set over there. So make sure you go check out her shop. It is linked down below along with my discount code of 15%. Make sure you go check out everything. Along with my crop, that will be all down below. My group is down there and everything else. Make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel. I would love to have you. I do upload between two to three times a week, design teams, collaborations, all of the fun stuff. Um, yeah, so that is all of that. Um, let's see here. I am getting ready to, this is going up in the month of November, obviously, so I'm getting ready to start to do December daily layouts. Oh, the red, the green, and the white. And as you, you know, yes. So there, there, there we have it. I got it. I didn't get to finish last year because I got sick of it. By <laughs> January, I was over the red, the green, and the white <laughs> for layouts. Because I did a lot in the month of December last year just to try to get it done um, and whatnot. So we'll see how I can do it this year because I'm not done with two years ago. And I have last year's to scrap. So we'll see what happens. We'll see if we can get um, close to being done. I do pull out Shimmer's Paints. And I give it a gold gold vibes. And then um, the still shots are coming up. So make sure that you like and subscribe. I hope that you guys are all staying safe. Have a wonderful day. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.